to school. I'm tired of this lifestyle. I'm tired of being fucking broke. My name is Saul Sanchez. I was born August 10th, 1996. Uh, I've lived all around Irving. I was born in Dallas. First four years, then I moved to Irving. I lived in Grand Prairie. I've even lived down in Jacksonville, North Carolina. That's way far east. And that's a military city. I lived there with my oldest sister, which is a Marine. I have three sisters. I currently live with my mom. My parents separated when I was a freshman in high school. And I've been living with my mom and my sister ever since. Well, my mom is my, my mom and my dad. She, she works two jobs. She gets paid minimum wage. I know that, uh, yeah, that's kind of bad. She, she's been working her whole life. I'm just trying to get her out of that, that state. Before I put myself in the house, I want to put my mom in the house. I guess we've been, we've always been living apartment to apartment, but I would like to have a nice house, you know. Just so, you know, it wouldn't it wouldn't hurt to have a a, a mansion, you know. <laughs> it wouldn't hurt. <laughs> it wouldn't hurt to have a mansion. It wouldn't hurt. Yo. Our, our living conditions they're not horrible. I wouldn't say I'm in poverty, but I'm not. Just like many other people, they're not in poverty, but they're just getting by, you know. Say fuck it, I'ma get high. A couple years from now, who survives? Who's gifted with beautiful sights Who separated themselves to stand out Who hated on the ones that put their plans down Into action Who felt obligated to commit crimes When they opened to music uh, I guess it would be my, my freshman year I saw I saw this rapper named Dumbfounded I was actually uh, browsing through YouTube uh, Watching battles And this dude This dude was funny as crap And I, I said dang what, what if I wish I could do that to someone is it just laugh and have a good time maybe with my homies and uh, who, who's, who has supported you the most from from day one up to the day who's the one who has supported you well uh so support is crazy man like like you you would think like people people want to people want to support you they, they like they they hear you and they you would think they want to support you but there's times when like i, I drop a song and like it, it might do really good but then i drop another song and i feel like it's a really good song but like i just don't get the same support i i feel like people support you when they see success off of you and that, that that's wrong it should work the other way they should support you before the success comes and and that's something really that i've really noticed like i don't know if you know this but only 13 percent of rappers actually make it to the music industry what I mean by that, I mean by actually being signed by, by labels. Uh, what do you have to say about that? What, what do you have to say about the stats about that? Well, it's funny you say that because I, I, I constantly think about that daily, whether I'm in class, whether I'm at home. And uh, when I see other rappers that are better than me, I'm like, I, I think to myself, like, dang, if, if, he, if he's, he hasn't made it or if he hasn't seen much success and why would I what what are my chances of making it what are why am I gonna be the one that makes it I I, I constantly ask myself that and it's just about your mindset that's the, that's the way I see it if, if you see if you're gonna do something then you're gonna go out there and do it but just don't prepare yourself for failure I don't know if I would categor categorize myself as a as a maybe as a conscious rapper or maybe as a gangster rapper. I just feel like when when I'm when I'm making a song, just what I feel at that moment, maybe express it in on a beat that I find, or maybe uh, I have to find a beat for the lyrics. It, it goes hand in hand. I just I, I wouldn't categorize myself. Maybe some but sometimes I do write conscious uh, lines, or maybe sometimes I do like to freestyle with the homies and talk about girls and their goodies. And maybe I just want to talk about what I see around me. Maybe some funny stuff, cartoons, TV, 
whatever's around me, whatever's in my head, I like to, to rap about. So I, I just have different moods. I don't I don't feel like I'm just uh, just a serious rapper where I where I, I, I should make sad songs and my depressing life all the time, but maybe put the happiness and the funny stuff and and everything just all all into different songs. You know, you you have endless thoughts. I like just write it down and express yourself to, through different manners. She loves me. And she's the reason why I can't break down, can't break down, can't break down, no I won't break down, can't break down. Yeah. Say the homies got some trees, we can break down. I spit them bars, you gotta break down. I'm just cruising in my civic, hoping it don't break down. Taking life by the minute, hoping I don't break down. Can't break down, can't break down, can't break down, can't break down, can't break down. Can't break down, can't break down Say I'ma do it like this, feeling like King Mike this With the golden touch I was holding the clutch But now I'm putting it down, cause I can't break down I can't break down, gotta stay strong And overpower every adversity versus me Doing whatever it takes to succeed Finding the key to master and lock this technique When life is oblique, gotta see it clear Face your fears or suffer the wrath of an uncertain path That'll turn you into a psychopath Until the cycle turns into aftermath Hold up, bringing it back, face your fears And find a solution, don't let that negative of energy start consuming to the point where you start confusing yourself and you need some help so take action before it's too late cause we all go through troubles every day just gotta find a way and tell yourself I can't break down let me hear you say I can't break down I can't break down 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 Yeah. <laughs>